Hello and welcome to another video. This is Nazmus Kandiker and you're watching Nazmus Labs. Well, guys, where today is another day and we are going to update from Windows 10 Insider Preview Build 14926 to 14931, I believe. So let's get started. Uh, if guys, if you if you enjoy the video, make sure to put a like and subscribe to this channel uh, it'll uh, really help me out uh, liking the video lets me know that you enjoy the content so I'll make more of it and subscribing make sure that you get the latest content as soon as they're available it also shows support for this channel so I just opened up the settings app and we're going to go to just the system about let me just open a magnifier so I could zoom in for you guys I'm gonna minimize this magnifier window so we have <coughs> we go to about and here you could see OS build is 14, 14926. So let's zoom out of here and let's get back to update and security Windows update. We are at update status. Your device is up, up to date. Last checked yesterday at 5:37 p.m. Uh, the reason it can't find an update is because it actually the update um, the build is released a few couple hours later. I came home at 9 and I said, oh my god, there's a new build. So I quickly turned my PC up. I shut it down because if I didn't, the PC would actually, I'm going to check for updates, the PC will act, would actually update at night when I was sleeping because that's that's outside of the active hours because, see there it found it, uh, Windows 10 and Sarah Preview Build for 14.9.31. So basically, uh, updates will be downloaded and installed automatically except over meter connection whenever the change, change is active hours. So active hours are... Uh, let active hours let let us know when you usually use the device. When you restart, when any start restart is nece necessary to finish and installing an update, we won't automatically restarting your device during an active hours. During active hours, note we'll check to see if your this device if you're using this device before attempting to restart. So, if you're using the device at active hours, it's not a restart button. Uh, if you're not using it and it's just on sitting there, and it's outside of this time period from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m it's going to automatically restart that's why I shut it down before I went to sleep so so I don't end up waking up today seeing that there's a new build and I can't you know get it for you guys so uh, there you go uh, Windows 10 bin inside a preview build 14.9.3.1 so download it's downloading the updates we're at 0 percent so oh well 1 percent look look you could see a little bit of the progress bar here um, so according to Microsoft Windows 10 blog blogs.windows.com uh, there is no new features in this build at least no notable ones I will try to go in depth and check out new features in the next video make, make sure to watch the next video for um, inshallah God willing I'll do it on the next video and make sure to watch the next video for details about what's new what's fixed and what's broken in Windows 10 build 14.9.3.1 so we're at four percent of downloading updates so we're getting there quickly enough so it's I think almost four gigabyte worth uh, the actual install is four gigabyte but um, I think that the update w updates like two and a half gigabytes for install.esd ESD is the install.esd is being updated and Windows is going to use that image file to uh, encrypted image file to update with the OS so we're at six percent doing very well so doing very well so guys how are you doing today so I could just pause the recording and come back when the when the download is finished or I could just chat with you guys guys in the comment below let me know at 7% what do you prefer do you prefer me um, just chatting with you guys while, you, while the update happens or do you want to actually me just want me to stop updating Windows 10 oh we're at 8% look at that not stop updating I'm, I'm sorry do you, do you prefer that I we sit through the entire progress and me just talk about it or do you want uh, do you prefer that uh, I actually pause the video and uh, can resume when you're closer to the update? Let me know, please. This really helps me. I, I want to know what you guys want, what you guys like, so I could do I could do what you guys prefer. Because you know, there, I don't. Oh, I have a message on my iPhone. Um, you know, there's no point of me just doing some a video and you guys don't prefer it. I don't want to waste my time and your time doing something you don't want, right? So. Uh, yeah, I just got uh, the notification I got is actually from YouTube. Speaking of uh, YouTube, actually, um, someone replied to my message. Uh, so this happened to me too. I don't know how to. Yeah, he. Is, I think he's talking about the anniversary update problems I was happening, having. So let's talk about the anniversary update, shall we? Um. So we have. 
the freezing issues actually so we've had this issue right so after update to the Windows 10 anniversary update right uh, back in I think the first one of the first few previews I think I skipped the very first free preview because I was out of the country um, but I think the second or third preview that it took of uh, Redstone 1 which is now known as Windows 10 anniversary update uh, one of the first previews I took uh, I noticed uh, a strange freezing issue okay so th the freezing issue caused my entire computer to freeze let me zoom in this the progress one. The freezing is issue caused the entire computer to freeze, and it would freeze for a few seconds or sometimes half half a minute, once in a while for a whole minute if not more. And it was, it, you could move the ra move around the mouse, move the mouse around, but nothing would happen. You click stuff, nothing would happen. And the w and then the computer would just automatically for no reason unfreeze, and um, the computer would unfreeze and. Yeah, and then every click I did, it would register. So if I imagine if I was frozen, I click the start menu or like an X button or a minimize or a menu item, and all those events would happen like really quickly, consecutively after the frozen fr freezing was over. So like the smart smart menu would start menu would would open up, the MIF program would minif minimize, context menu would, you know, uh, context menu would come up and stuff. That that's uh, that was very annoying and. You know, guys, um, I really want to talk about the freezing issue, actually. So, I think I should make a new video, right? Talk about the freezing, freezing issue, right? I should update you guys with what's happening, and um, I'll, I should make a new video talking about it, how it happened, which computers it affected me on, and uh, yeah, I th yeah, guys. So, if you're if you're more, if you're more interested, because there's something happened. Uh, I think this freezing issue is related to the um, the hard drive uh, Windows 10 was being used on um, that is very interesting because uh, it wasn't based on the PC and I, I want to talk about why I will I will want to talk about why it's it wasn't the PC that was affecting the freezing issue it's the type of it was the brand literally the brand of hard drive that was causing me the pre freezing <coughs> freezing issues and I'll talk about why that is because I actually swapped hard drive and oh and only on, on the PCs where I put that one brand of hard drive in there, the freezing or is issues would occur. Not it was not related to the PC. So, yeah, I'll talk about that in another video. So I'll definitely do that, inshallah. So guys, if you're interested in that, make sure to watch that video. So okay, all right. And you know what? I'm gonna re pause the video now, and I'll resume after we uh, go further ahead. Right. So let me know what you want. Uh, do you want me to pause it, or do you want actually want to watch the entire thing and me talk about you know ramble different different stuff. Thank you guys. Uh, let me know. I, I really want to know what you what, what I really want to know what you want or what do you think. So yeah, I'll I'll, uh, I'll pause the video right now and I'll come back. Oh, 25 percent. Nice stopping point. All right, guys. Uh, all right, guys. Uh, we okay, have uh, in the restart required notification here. We'll restart your computer. You restart your device uh, outside of the active hour. Select the message to select active hours. Or restart now. So I could click restart now. Or just click here to open up Windows Update. And I have the restart now option. So what I'm going to do, inshallah, right now is turn the my screen recording off and begin the restart process. I'm going to use my smartphone to record the process. So see you, see you in a bit. All right, guys. We're guys. We are just finished in preparing to install update. Uh, sorry. Finish downloading updates. Now we're preparing to install updates. We are at one percent, so three percent. So it's actually going by pretty quickly. Five percent. So we are installing update, guys. Um, we're preparing for the big, the big run, the big, the big jump or big sprint, whatever you want to call it. Uh, it's going to get to hundred percent, and we would be on our way to installing Windows 10 Redstone 2 build 14.931. So th oh, 14 percent. We have uh, really jumped from five to 14. Oh, nine jump. I was going to say a total of nine jump. And now we're all the way to 5 to 23 so now we're at 23 percent that's almost 18 jumps we're like multiplying by 9 right so actually multi uh, is, is a multiple of 9 times 2 right adding 9 to it not multiplying by 9 that'd be that'd be huge we're, a we're adding by 9 so will the next one be 32 32 maybe maybe after that it's 41 I don't know it's stuck at 23 for a while so uh, make sure I, I was gonna say I was make sure I have internet connection but I don't need to worry about it because you know it's finished downloading it's just installing it very good so 
Yeah, uh, that's. Uh, I'll, I guess it's not going anywhere. So I'll, I'll be back. Oh, oh, oh no. Okay, I'll be back. Uh, I'll be back when this goes fur fur further. Inshallah. See ya. All right, guys. We are at ninety percent of downloading Windows Ten Insider Preview fourteen three fourteen nine three one. And guys, I have to let you know something important. Uh, I lost internet connection. I didn't realize. Then I have to get back to. The, I have to reconnect myself. And I hope that didn't interrupt the download. It's being stuck at 90%. Hopefully it didn't do anything. Oh no, it didn't. So it's 91%. So yeah, okay. So it's still re it's still downloading. I thought maybe losing the connection would cause it to re uh, screw up the download and re having to reset. Uh, but yeah, it's 92%. So we're again there. So soon, inshallah, they're gonna have a preparing to install and an update will happen, inshallah. So guys, let's get ready for this. The big time. It's time for a big update. All right, guys. Uh, what happened is basically, uh, I, uh, you know, we we're like doing the update, and I had to go. I went to the, I went to the restroom actually, and <laughs> when I came back, my cousin uh, Wasig decided to tell me that, uh, hey, look, your computer's d decided to do its things on its own, and uh, I, I went, I did not want to update this. I, I was hoping that uh, I'll come back. I'll have to go. I was going to go do some. Uh, I had some matters to take care of. I thought I'd do those and come back and update. And my computer, because Windows 10 always, always loves to auto-update, decided to do the update for me without my permission. And so after my cousin told me about the situation, I decided, oh no, I quickly took my iPhone out and immediately started recording this. So sorry you didn't get to see me click the restart button, but we are at 17% working in updates. Do not turn off your PC. This will take a while. So I have to... Uh, basically, this is going to take a while, but I have to go and leave. I have to go somewhere right now. And because of that, I won't be able to stay here to fin watch the entire update happen. So, tell you what I'm going to do. Um, I'm Once update's finished, inshallah, what's going to happen is that we're going to be on a new build. So, and I want, I will give you a full tour of the new build, including the app updates. And that, inshallah, is going to come out tomorrow, if not the same day as this video. So... So if you're enjoying this video, make sure to watch the next video because I'm going to tour you, uh, give you a tour you of this build. Make watch the next video, see what's new in this build of Windows 10, and rock rock on and comment or comment your uh, reactions. What do you think of the build uh, features? But yeah, it's coming up, so make sure to click the link. I'll have the link in the description below. Whoops. Also a thumbnail on the thing. I'll try to put a thumbnail here. Uh, so yeah, if you like the video, make sure to like and subscribe. And um, for more information, definitely if you have any questions or comments, definitely ask me and I'll try my best to answer them. Yeah, so see you in the next video. Let's take a look at what's new in Windows 10. Goodbye. The computer restarted and we're at 39, 35% complete. It's going to restart one more time and we should be done.